Cheyenne, how was your 12-step meeting? Uh, Reba, those meetings are anonymous. She's not supposed to talk about them. Oh, no, 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 I can talk about my meetings. And they're going really well. I mean, like, really, really, really well. I don't know why, but I just, I don't feel the need to drink at all. <laughs> so how was your day? <laughs> Give me that thing. Oh, what do you think you're doing? I'm smoking. Look, it's no big deal. I'll quit before it affects my looks. <laughs> I'm a little more worried about your health and the health of everybody around you. Well, almost everyone. I do not think smoking is that bad for you. I think tobacco is a vegetable. <laughs> Cheyenne, take it from me. It is not worth it. I mean, sure, you look cool and sophisticated. You know, especially if you got a sterling silver case and a holder like I did. Wait, you used to smoke? Pack a day. And I'm telling you, smoking makes you a social pariah. Nobody wants anything to do with you. Are you sure they knew you smoked? Ha <laughs> ha, <laughs> Fraulein. <laughs> okay, look, I know it's bad for me, but it helps me not want to drink. Honey, if you're having a hard time with this, maybe I shouldn't have this party for my clients. I mean, there'll be a lot of drinking there. No, Mom, look, I told you, I cannot live in some fake world and pretend that alcohol doesn't exist. I just need to smoke right now to help me get through this. Look, let's work something out. Cheyenne, I'm sure if you quit smoking, mm -hmm. Reba will let you have a snort now and then. Yeah. <laughs> no! She will not smoke and she will not drink. As for you, you can smoke and drink. Go skydiving for all I care. <laughs> I bet she's the life of Oktoberfest. <laughs> Man, Cheyenne, your mom's got a bug up her nose. She's all over me, how I should be watching you like a hawk and what a tough time you're going through. And grr, I'm Reba. You know how she is. Wait, why are you supposed to be watching me? Was she asking about my drinking again? Yeah, like I don't pay attention. I should have been, look, red. I'm her husband. I got this. I know what she's up to, but I didn't. You know why? Because I'm afraid of her. You know starting to get on my nerves. I mean, you, you admit that you have a problem, you take the steps to deal with it, and then all of a sudden everybody treats you like you're a completely different person. Well, why? Can't everyone realize that I'm just the same old Cheyenne as I always was? Exactly. I realize it because I'm aware. Hey, can I have one of those vitamins? Give me a Wilma and a Dino. You know what? I had a Dino yesterday. Make it a Barney. No, man, those vitamins are not for you. Are those chick vitamins? Well, I grow boobs. No. Okay, I'm gonna tell you something, but you cannot repeat it. It's called disulfiram. You're right, I can't repeat that. It's a prescription medicine for alcoholics. It makes you violently ill if you drink alcohol. A pill that makes you sick if you drink? Well, doesn't that ruin drinking? What's the point? It's called booze away. Oh, mm -hmm. cool. Yeah. I know that if I have one of these, I can't have a drink. So why are you hiding them from your mom? Because I don't want her to find out. She's been on my case about everything. She's always snooping around, looking for signs of trouble. So promise me, man, if she asks you as far as you're concerned, those are just vitamins. Got it. Mm. Mm. Thank you, honey. <coughs> Have you always smoked? <laughs>